Hello there. In this video, I'm going to talk about um, what the structuring Go is. And I'm going to show you a very simple example of uh, what you can do with it. So right away, let's create a small test program. As usual, I'm opening main. There we go. So, to create a structure, you first need to declare it. So, in this case, it's a type. We call it student. That's the way you do it. In this structure, I'm going to put uh, two properties. Uh, the name, which we'll put as a string and the h, which we'll put as an integer. So this is done. Now that this is defined, let me declare a student name Chris, for example. So if I do it this way, uh, this will actually work. And let me print the result right away. As you can see, uh, I declared it uh, empty. There's no properties inside of it at this moment. So let's save it. Let's print it. Go around, does that go? And empty object. So now, let's actually declare some property inside. This is the way you do it. Chris, that name equal so it has to be a string Chris and let's put an age as well Chris that age equal 30 maybe I'm lying a bit go run does that go and I forgot to save it no I forgot to do another print here of the change There we go. Go around, see the difference. First, the structure was empty. Now it has my name and my age. Mine is a few years. Um, so now, this is a one way to do it. Now, let's say we would like to create a function that uh, changes the name to whichever uh, we want. So. We declare the function, change name. And we put, um, we have to declare a pointer on the student. And in this case, I'm gonna put a name as a string. So it can be a variable. And right here on the pointer, that name I put equal to uh, I'm gonna change this to name chosen to name chosen there we go so now that this function is ready let's say I were to call it change name I need a pointer on the structure so same way you do it with pointers, you use this, put Chris, and a string. Let's change it to V. Let's uh, do another FMT print of Chris and see what the changes are. And there we go. So it actually works. If I put Lee, this happens. If I put August, so this happens. The, um, this is it for this example. Uh, try to understand it and um, you will be able to manipulate structures. Uh, thank you for watching until next time.